everybody, what is up? My name is Island Tigantigi and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new to my YouTube channel, I would really appreciate it if you could like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, it really does mean the world to me. And in today's video, I want you guys to guess what just came in the mail. So as you guys read by the title, in today's video I'll be doing another Brandy Melville UK haul. I absolutely adore Brandy Melville, so now that I'm in the UK, I thought I should order some clothes ASAP and basically try them on, try them out. This will be like a try on haul. I'll be showing you guys what I got and I'll be trying on and showing you guys. Well here is the parcel and we are just gonna open it right up and see what is inside. I actually ordered this parcel like a month ago. It came in three days, but I wasn't in the UK yet, but now I'm in the UK and I finally get to open it. I'm so so excited. Without further ado, I'm not gonna keep you guys waiting and we're gonna go straight to opening the parcel. Oh look at that. Can you see that? Look! Oh my gosh, it looks so nice. Okay, I'm gonna try to slide them all out at once. Ooh! So let's see what we have. Whoa, where did that come from? Okay, so I just opened up my billing stuff. A bunch of stickers came out. Look at all of these. And it's not just a few stickers, they gave me so many. Look how adorable these are. These are kind of vintage. Some of them say London. A few days ago, I was scrolling on Instagram to kind of prep myself to film this video. And I heard online that when you order some clothes, that Brandy Melville can ship you extra clothes if you order a bunch. And I'm guessing this time they sent me a bunch of stickers, which I absolutely love. So the first kind of sticker I got is these like vintage ones, kind of like pop art that say chill since 1993. And then I think the second one says London Chelsea. So I'm guessing that's like the location of the shop. I, mean, I think I'm gonna stick them on my laptop or my phone case. That is super cute. Look at all of these. So cute. Okay, so now that we've seen the stickers, I think we're gonna hop straight into the jewelry. So here is the jewelry. It came in this nicely sealed bubble wrap and it has this really, really nice I'll meet you in New York sticker on it. I kind of don't wanna take this off. I don't wanna ruin the sticker. I think I'm just gonna slide it out. So the first things I actually bought from Brandy was the gold star chain choker. So this is a super cute choker with a bunch of stars on it. And I've been dying to get one of these for the longest time. So as you can see, it's a really, really pretty chain and they have these really aesthetic stars on them, which I find super, super cute. I've been wanting to get one of these necklaces for the longest time. I'm not sure why, but they always seem super cute. I just think they're so pretty. And I think they'll go well with loads of outfits because for me, I feel like jewelry is one of the most important things to accessorize an outfit with. Like you can tear an outfit from a 5 to a 10 just by adding some jewelry to it. So I felt like this was a must have and I've never bought a piece of jewelry from Brandy before. And people have said that the jewelry there is really, really good. So why not try it out? So that is the gold star chain choker for you guys. Okay, so now that I'm done with the jewelry, I'm going to skip on straight to the top and then I'm going to do the trousers and then the jackets. I am I'm about to show you guys what they are and what they look like and try them all on which I'm very very excited for. Okay we're gonna start with the first top. So this is the first top that I got sent to me by Brandy. So this top is called the Ashland Los Angeles USA top. So I fell in love with this top when I saw it on the website. It is super super pretty. Brandy sends their clothes. On my last whole video, I was talking about how nice their clothes smell and everyone in the comments were like, Brandy sends their clothes. I want to know what they sent it with, so if anyone knows, please tell me. It smells so good. It smells so, so good. So this top is very soft. I think it's made of cotton and it is super stretchy. Like you can see it's stretched really far. Look at that. That is so stretchy. I love this. You can see the writing here. It isn't embroidered. Could flake off a bit, but I hope it doesn't. As you can see, the fabric looks very, very good quality. I'm hoping it will fit. So the top on the website looked like it would be a more of a navy blue color, and in real life, it's a bit more of a coolish toned gray blue, which I'm not complaining about. I absolutely adore it. I think this top is super, super pretty. I love it. I'm very, very excited to wear it. I've been looking at this a lot on the website. So moving on to the second top I bought from Brandy. Which so this is the Sheena tank, I'm pretty sure. So I got it in the color brown, because I feel like brown looks good on everybody. The thing I like about all of Brandy's 
these clothes is that their logo is kind of imprinted onto the clothes. Sometimes it isn't. I really like the way that it looks. I'm pretty sure this top is also made of cotton. This one isn't scented. I mean, they can't scent everything, but the scent of the clothes that are scented so so good it's also super stretchy which i really really like the problem with most tanks i buy the bottoms are always weirdly cut but i think for this one it's kind of frilled at the bottom of it and i feel like that adds to the vintage vibes of this top i bought the tank because i feel like everyone should have a basic in their closet and i don't have that many basics and i feel like basics are very very important to style a bunch of different outfits so i really really had to hop on and buy a bunch of these and i bought this beautiful beautiful tank i absolutely am in love with the color it's almost the color of my hair which hopefully will look nice when i wear it but overall this is super super pretty i love it so so much so here is the next top i got from brandy melville so like i said i need to buy a few more basic items so this is the laureen tank i'm pretty sure the laureen tank is a different fabric compared to the last two for example this one as you can see it has like lines it's very soft so it's definitely made out of cotton again i'm guessing and it has this kind of pattern on it while the other ones have more of this kind of pattern the neck is really nice like i like the way that the neck kind of goes down here this one is also super super stretchy and that's probably because it's made out of cotton on this tank the bottom isn't ruffled it's sewn together so they basically folded it over and sewed it there which i like a lot because i feel like it adds to the look of it this one is scented yes yes uh, I swear their clothes smell like a Lush store. Cute. This one has their traditional... I don't know if it's traditional, but most brandy clothes has a label like this. This one has very nice straps. They're not too thin, they're not too thick, they're just super stretchy as well. And that was the Laureen tank for you guys. So now we are moving on to our second to last top, which is this one. So this one is the Nicola Ruffle Tank. So if you guys haven't noticed, I've been obsessed with wearing tanks recently, which is why I bought like a bunch of them. The next top isn't a tank, I promise, but I really, really like this one. They had one in pink and I fell in love with that one. Pink isn't really my color. It doesn't really suit me that well. So the thing that really drew me to the top is the ruffles. You can see how the top is ruffling. The ruffles are super stretchy as well. I think that's to do with the fact that there's an elastic behind here on the top. And they also have that across the bottom of the top. So like the other top, it's more of a v-neck. And the back is more open. This one isn't scented, which is super sad, but I really like the color. The very calm, muted blue is very, very pretty. I personally really, really like it. This was the Nicola Ruffle Tank. This one's super cute. I really like it. So the next up we have from Bat from Bandy? No, not from Bandy, from Brandy. The next up we have from Brandy is the Page Ruffle Top. Look how absolutely gorgeous this is. Look at that. Do you see that? Uh, look at the neck that is gorgeous look at the collar i love it it has ruffled sleeves it has ruffled bottoms and it has buttons down the middle as soon as i saw this top i knew i need to get it it is absolutely gorgeous look at it look i love it this one isn't scented but i still love it oh this one's label is a bit smaller than the other ones as you can see it doesn't have the heart that usually brandy marble clothes do have but yeah this is super super cute i love the buttons the fabric on this top is very thick compared to the other ones i'm guessing because that's it's white and it doesn't want to be see-through I'm just like obsessed with how vintage this one is. This one is so pretty. And I've wanted a top like this for a very, very long time. I absolutely love the color, how the color is ruffled. That's so cute. So that is the page ruffle top thing. This one's my favorite so far. So now I'm going to move on to the bottoms. And I actually only got one bottom this time. But I felt like this was a bottom that was essential to me. So I don't own any sweatpants at all. Like, I've never bought sweatpants. I want more of a perfect of a place to get the iconic, iconic Brandy Melville Roses sweatpants. They're very long. In the picture, the color was a bit more gray. In real life, it's a light blue color. It's elastic at the bottom. Kind of scrunches inwards like a scrunchie. The top is the exact same, but I'm happy it's like this so the waist would fit a bit better. It has pockets! Look, it has pockets. Oh, the pockets are the same fabric. 
It's very thick. Oh, and the insides. So the insides are very fluffy. I'm hoping that this isn't too big for me. But these are really soft. I like them a lot. I think right now in England, it's not too hot, so it's perfect time to wear these. They do look really comfortable, and I think I can make some great outfits with them, so we're gonna stay optimistic about it. So yeah, those were the rosy sweatpants, and we're gonna move on to our last item of the day, which is the Billy sweater. So I got the Billy sweater because it defines my aesthetic as a person. It's just so cute, and I it's just so pretty. And when I saw it, this was the first thing I added to the basket, that sent me on this entire journey of buying a bunch of clothes is practically the reason why I'm making this video it's because look how gorgeous it is can you see that? it's so gorgeous it's a knitted sweater as you can see it's knitted it's extremely stretchy it's a really nice light pink color it's like in real life I don't know if you can see it but it's kind of like the color of my top but a bit lighter it kind of looks like candy floss color this one's slightly scented like not as scented as the first two but this one is definitely still scented the, the buttons look way better than they did on picture look how cute they are I love the stitch work right here so this one go has a v-neck it is also cropped and it is also long sleeved it's so soft I like it it's like a black Blanket. This one has a heart label. So that is everything I got from Brandy Melville. If you guys like this video, I would really, really appreciate it. Again, if you could subscribe, like the video, it does mean a lot to me. Please don't forget to comment so YouTube shows my videos to more people. And it really does mean the world to me. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys consider buying some of these clothes. All the links will be in the description. And I love you guys so, so much. I hope you have a great day. And I'll see you next video. Love you. Bye.